guys, this is not the video I had planned for this week. Um, I had another completely different video lined up. And, um, just like, <sighs> I, 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 I couldn't, I had to, I had to change course. On the 4th of July, um, instead of fireworks, uh, we went to see the Sound of Freedom movie, and words do not do justice. It is the best movie in years. And that's that's not an understatement. Like I said, words words don't do the film justice. You know, while watching the film It's emotional, man. You know, it makes you think a lot. And it kind of shifts your your take on the world as a whole. And, um... Especially in regard to... The media. And, um... Our country. And... Just so many different things. Like I said, words do not do justice the only way to really to really know how unbelievable this movie is you have to go go see it there's there's no there's no other way around it i can't i can't just convey the message that the movie conveyed and the things that the movie was able to show it really it really hit me um now i'm not i'm only 21 i don't have a fam i don't have like a family of my own i don't have kids or anything like that but um i i've never i don't think i've said this on the channel before but the main thing that i do when I'm not making these videos, is um, I'm working in childcare, specifically like preschool age, right? And I'm taking child development classes as well uh, for that. And uh, not very many people, you know, are are blessed in the way that I am. That I have the opportunity to work in a space like that, and I w I. I think everybody should at least take, you know, these classes about child development and stuff because it's so crucial no matter what, you know, your vocation is. But, you know, watching this movie, now I'm, I don't, yeah, the, the kids in this movie are older, but not by very much, you know only a few years and um, I think the youngest age that they said to my knowledge is the kid was seven or eight something like that and that's only a couple years you know that's not that's not that the, the age gap is not that big so I'm watching this movie you know about this horrible stuff that's happening to these young kids and um, you know the closest thing that I have because I can never I can never um know I like in the state I am right now, I can I will never be able to, you know, know what it's like for parents to have their 
you know, child taken away because I don't have any, you know, but the closest thing I have is, you know, the kids that I work with and, um, I mean, I, as much as I can, right, you know, love these little kids. And that just puts it into perspective because if I love them this much, I can't imagine how much their parents love these, love them. And how much pain parents have when their kids get taken like this. You know, while watching the movie, I thought of every single one individually, like if it happened to them. This is, this is what the devil wants. So the world is designed now where it's designed to distract you. Say so you're not aware of what's actually going on. You know, this movie has was was complete five years ago and it's just getting out now because the devil doesn't want it to to get out but it's out now so we already lost if you can if you can just please just go see this movie okay it's absolutely life changing I just, I don't know what else to say. I, I can't, I can't, I can't convey, you know, I can't, just like, yeah, words cannot describe. So, try to go see this, as, you know, whenever you can. Um, they're even giving out free tickets. <laughs> so the way they get the free tickets is, you know, people donate and buy them for other people. You know, so if you want free tickets, if you can't afford to to pay for it, then you don't ha you don't have to. Okay. So if you don't if you don't have money to to you know if you just can't fi afford it financially right now, um, you can get free tickets. I'm not entirely exactly sure where, but I'll figure it out and put the link in the description or whatever. And, um... Uh, I don't know what else to say. I was not planning to make this at all. Um, again, a completely different video. It, it, completely different video was planned. But this hit me so hard. I... This isn't a, a movie review or anything, so that's why I'm not getting too into depth with the plot and all that. And, you know, I am trying to keep it as family friendly as possible, you know, so I, I don't want to, I don't want to go into specifics about things that happen in the movie and, you know, but worse don't do it justice. Go see The Sound of Freedom unbelievable movie unbelievable movie hope you guys enjoyed if you didn't make sure to blast the like button oblivion subscribe if you haven't already i'll see you next video until then pray that rosary
use your sacraments, go to reconciliation, repent of your sins. And actually, I forgot one thing. If you made it to the end, well, lucky you. Um, speaking of praying the rosary, um, I'm gonna be done selling the rosaries on the Etsy shop. I don't know if you guys have bought any from there, but um, I'm not gonna sell them anymore. What I'm instead is going to do is if you guys want a rosary or need a rosary or you want one that I made, just let me know it down in the comments and then I'll I'll make one for you and just send it over. Okay. Cause everyone needs a rosary. Okay, it shouldn't be something with a price tag on it. I just that's just that's what I feel called to do. I just you know so because everyone needs a weapon, okay? Everyone needs a weapon. All right, that's enough for me for now. God bless everybody. See ya. Boom.